And a very good evening to all my viewers out there. So we're here at St. Joseph's Oratory. Uh, right now it is Wednesday, February the 6th, 2019. It's about 10.02 p.m. And look at this. Totally shocked by this. I knew it was coming because they're uh, doing some renovations. Not just renovations, but restructuring here at St. Joseph's Oratory. But look at this. They've demolished, I think it's called the Visitor's Pavilion. And to put this in perspective, this building, I believe, was built maybe a little bit later, but around the same time as uh, the oratory was built. And they've totally demolished it. This is incredible. And you can uh, understand my reaction when I got here because this uh, building that uh, you're seeing here, what's left of it, I used to come here a lot and do uh, not just videos, but just to, to sit and relax because it offered a spectacular view northwest of here. Uh, it's really incredible to see this. And uh, you know, it's nighttime right now, so you can't really see much. But then, uh, you know, seeing that I'm filming in 4K, might be able to show you a little more here. Look at this. Wow. That's history right there that's being demolished. Incredible. Now, just to give you a bit of background information here, um, this is St. Joseph's Oratory, of course. It was built uh, 1900s or so. I think I would know the date because I, uh, I love this place. But yeah, between, uh, I think it was the 1900s to 1930s. Um, built by Father Andre, now Saint Andre. And uh, they started with a little chapel, which I did a video of a while back over there. Can't really see it. But uh, I'll get to the point. What they're doing now is they're doing a huge renovation project. Um, basically, they're going to be opening up the dome soon, that uh, big dome in, on the Basilica, which I'll try to show you in a minute. But also, they're tearing down a lot of structures, and they're going to be rebuilding them. So this has been uh, talked about for years now, you know, and, and I think since 2009 maybe. I've been hearing about, oh, we're going to be doing this to the oratory, doing that to the oratory. And, uh, you know, i never seen anything major going on. You know, a few little renovations. I know they did the sidings and stuff of uh, the Basilica. But uh, here, I'll show you here what I'm talking about. Right up here is the main Basilica. So yeah, up here they, they redid all those sidings and tiles. And that dome up there, by the way, they're going to be opening that to visitors, which is what I'm really excited for. But this here, you know, they were doing little projects and they showed the plans of what these projects were going to look like when they finished. And, uh, you know, this is going on for at least 10 years, maybe even 12 years, because I think 2007 was the first mention of this. And uh, now, look, they're actually doing it. They're doing huge steps now. They're, they're demolishing structures. They're, uh, you know, rebuilding things. This is incredible. So I'm going to come here during the daytime because it uh, gives you, obviously, more light to see. But again, really uh, shocked to see this. Not, I knew it was coming, but I didn't know it was coming now. And by the way, not only that, they also knocked down the Carolyn, which are the bells that they, uh, they, it's a bunch of bells that are on the roof of the structure adjacent to this one. And they're different sized bells. And uh, basically they make music as the, I guess the hammers hit them. And that's been torn down too. Now they're gonna rebuild it. But again, pretty shocking because I've had a lot of memories here. Uh, you know, but uh, that's, that's the way she goes. I mean, they're gonna modernize it. And I hope they put some kind of observatory there because that was one of the places that I love to go it was one of my favorite places in the city was to sit up there on that balcony and uh, especially when there was thunderstorms watching the thunderstorms coming in from the west great place because you could see the storms approaching and uh, there was shelter and uh, it's a bit emotional right now like I said I mean this this place was one of my uh, sanctuaries 
and uh, you know sometimes they try to make things better but they end up making them worse I hope hope this isn't the case yeah I'll get a daytime video guys so anyway have a good night and uh, see y'all soon